Hey, welcome back to the magical world of Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. Man, I was on a roll. Okay, I'll give you a coin. I for the day with a single coin. I I don't believe that. Thank you, kind lady. You're you're welcome. All right, you just you just hang tight. <laughs> um, okay, the last time I joined you in Boogledorf's quest, it was like two years ago, and before that, it was also two years before that. So really, at this point, you just need to accept that. Each each video you get in in this playthrough is a precious gift, <laughs> a special treasure uh, that you'll get perhaps only several several times in your life, and it's really best you come to terms with that and don't ask too many questions. What do you think? Why do you bother me? Go away. Yeah, I didn't want to talk to you anyway. <laughs> Alright, so I think I was on the Thieves Guild Lost History. Scriva of the Thieves Guild has asked me to find out what happened to the thief named Theranus. He was sent to steal a book entitled Lost Histories of Tamriel from the Wizard in the Castle Skingrad. Oh, Skingrad. Oh, oh dear. My job is to recover the book. Scriva doesn't care. Blah, blah, blah. I'm getting 400 gold coins. Great. Fantastic. Where? Okay, Skingrad. That, that's kind of... A long way, isn't it? Nah, it's not too far away. I should, I should really get on a horse. What a, what a good opportunity to catch up with you, my like, one or two viewers. How have you been? <laughs> it's probably not. You know, a lot has happened in the past two years. Oh, beautiful lady. I'm so hungry. Oh, not anymore. Thank you, kind lady. Oh, they're calling me kind. They're calling me beautiful. These folks, they know how to, they know how to butter, ah! Oh! They know how to butter a gallop. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't mean to go third person there. Why would the third person button be on F anyway? Don't you think the F would stand for first person? That's something to think about. Uh, just blocking the way. This is the only entrance to Breville and you're, you're just standing right here. Very rude. Oh, that guy's a little more polite. Getting my extremely good horse, who's injured slightly? I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, it's probably not the best time to be... Well, I mean, it's kind of a good time to check up on all of y'all, because... I mean, my gap kind of covered... A really terrible year, didn't it? <laughs> so, so now everyone's on the other side of it. Um, it. Are you doing okay? Are things better? Are things worse? I hope they're not worse. I think there are for some people, unfortunately. Um, you. That's a bandit. I'm gonna ignore him. <laughs> oh. Oh no, oh she's oh she's walking straight for him. Oh boy, I can't I can't justify. Hello? What do you want? Um, well a little rude, but you're still an innocent civilian. Oh see, no, she's nice. Oh, wait. I'm a little unfamiliar with the controls at this point. Oh was that you? No, I think that was me. <laughs> Steel arrow. Well, at least I get that back. That's nice. Where are you going? <laughs> Shadowmere, I think, has a mind of her own. I'm not sure how much the Oblivion AI is really capable of, but I wouldn't I wouldn't put it past this game for the smartest um, NPC to be to be Shadowmere. I think that would just about line up. I know there's a boar behind me. I'm ignoring it. There's another boar. I'm gonna ignore it. You know, I'd love to if <laughs> I'd love to know for anyone who may live in an area where there's boar, <laughs> which is a lot of places, especially in like the south, I think. Um 
do boars just straight up attack you if they lay eyes on you? I don't think so. But I don't know. I've never seen a boar in the wild. Maybe in a zoo or something. But that doesn't really tell you anything. Hello? <laughs> How? You know what? He's having some troubles. I'm just gonna leave him be. <laughs> ay ay ay. Oh, the music in this game is so nice. Ay ay ay. I think I've updated the graphics since the last time. Imperial City. Bravo. Late one. I know Skingrad is this way. I'm just gonna go. I don't... Pell's Gate. I don't remember this place. I have absolutely no memory of this place. Absolutely none. Then again, there's a lot I don't remember. Because as I say, it's been two years since the last Oblivion video. And then before that, there was a sizable gap. So basically, everything I've done in this game is a little bit of a blur. <laughs> Every so often, I, I, I indulge my ego and I rewatch some of my old videos and I'm like, <laughs> wow, I'm a, I'm a comedy legend. Wow, no one makes as good of Oblivion Let's Plays as I do. <laughs> but what have I done? And that's... I know, who, who am I? Who am I? I got the good skills. I know that. Yeah, I'm the champion of Cyrodiil. I know that. I'm an honorary knight of the thorn. It is kind of funny that that's included in all these official honors. I'm knight sister of the blades, which I think is the highest you can get there. And then of course I'm the master of the fighter's guild and listener for the dark brotherhood. I do vaguely remember those things, especially dark brotherhood. Because that's always very fun. Hello? Welcome to Pell's Gate, friend. Oh, everyone's very friendly here. Way shrines of RK confer blessings of health on those who've pleased the nine by righteous acts. Hmm. That's interesting, because RK is you kind do. of he's also the god of death, but he's he's the god of death and he's the god of healing. So it's kind of an interesting Sorry. relationship there. Come Valkyrie to Windhelm! Well, Windhelm is a city in Skyrim, I think. Sleeping. Okay, oh, so that's an inn. Everyone here kind of is not doing so great. I saw some mud crabs by the water recently. I steered clear of them. Disgusting creatures. I hope to never see another. I. Yeah. Okay. Hey, what's your problem? Welcome to Pell's Gate, friend. He's essential. Why is he essential? Enough talk. Why are you essential? Okay, you know what? what what's up with you? Welcome to Pell's Gate. They friend. all say the same thing. I'm starting Fighting's to get easy. Just lead them out on the water and shoot them full of holes. If you've got a bow, of course, and can walk on water. Oh, can can you? You too. Are those? Key. Oh. <clears throat> Are those water walking boots? You know what? That's fine. You can have them. <laughs> I say as if I, you know, was gonna. I don't know. <sighs> this is a kind of a weird little settlement. What's. Brief history of the Empire, crumpled pieces of paper. <sighs> Getting weird vibes. Welcome to Pell's Gate. They friend. all say the exact same thing. All that stuff about having to set trolls on fire is a bunch of hooey. They don't like fire, but a good sword will cut them up fine. Uh, see, I could have See, I could have sworn it was said or written or something somewhere in the Elder Scrolls that fire is good against trolls, but then you have a character saying it's all hooey. So I don't know what to believe. It's all it's all very confusing. What is it what does it mean? You know? 
What, what does any of it mean in this world? I can't, I can't, <laughs> I can't, I can't wait for this to be the legacy left, left to my grandchildren. Just a bunch of, just a bunch of YouTube videos, um, re recorded, um, intermittently. Um, <laughs> like, this is it. This is the single greatest sampling of your grandmother's voice. What a, what a treasure. What a, what a trove of ancient wisdom. And they listen to it and it's just a bunch of like, just, just what, like, what the kids and what uh, the children in my day, they referred to this as cringe. They created compilations of things that were cringe. And I, I was, I was masterful of creating, creating cringe. A lost art. Everything created nowadays, it all makes, it all makes sense, it's all, it's all funny and enjoyable and not embarrassing and, uh, back in my day we weren't afraid to embarrass ourselves. <laughs> we weren't afraid of a little humiliation. Oh god. Oh god, there's just like, um, I'm just ignoring you, I'm just ignoring you, I'm just ignoring you. <laughs> I can't, I can't deal with this, I can't deal with this. How many trolls are out today? I'm level 10, which doesn't seem very high. Also, have I never taken this road before? Because I'm discovering a bunch of shit. But uh, I'm level 10, which doesn't seem super high, but I guess it must be high enough. Oh, Jesus. How many, is that two band? No, it's a guard. Okay, you know what? You can deal with that. <laughs> I'll, I'll defend a, a, a civilian Khajiit woman, but uh, I'll leave the guards to their own devices. Ugh. How derelict mine. <laughs> I was about to say, how derelict can it really be if they have a, you know, a nice fire pit outside? But I guess the skeleton... What are these two skeletons up to? They're both headless, but... Oh dear. I'll just leave them to it. <laughs> There's a graveyard? I feel like I've never noticed a graveyard before. I'm not gonna bother it, because I feel like the last time I bothered like a tomb or or urn or whatever it was, um, what was it? when I was stealing the the bust of the deceased wife of the Count of Shadenhall, I got haunted with good reason because you know it's not. I mean that didn't seem like a very nice thing to do. <laughs> I feel like the general vibe of the Thieves Guild is a Robin Hood sort of thing of like, oh yes, we're friends to the to the poor and the beggars, uh, and the rich. The rich can go fuck themselves. And that's a message I can get behind. <laughs> but, I don't know, taking like the bust of someone's dead wife doesn't seem very much in that spirit. I don't know. I don't know anything. I've never known a single thing in my entire life. This head is empty. Okay, I have multiple... I assume the pointers are going to the beggars because they always know stuff. Hello? I'm only asking for a single... I'm saving up enough for some medicine. I can just... I have a bunch of shit on me. I can just give you... Hey, uh... What's your, uh... What's your opinion on that, uh, Glarther fellow? Did you hear? He went crazy and started attacking people with an axe. Oh. But luckily, the guards stopped him before he killed anyone. Yeah. That's good. Don't think too hard about whoever he was seen with in the days before that happened. 
Okay. Here's what I know. Aranis was drinking in the two <laughs> sisters' lodge. The and two Aranis sisters' lodge. From the castle. Well, that was stupid. Unfortunately, Captain Dion was also in the two sisters' lodge. He arrested. Wait, your voice just completely changed. <laughs> what direction did they give this voice actor? Of, of course, I'm not going to actually blame the voice actors in Oblivion for anything because, as we all know. There's, like, five very overworked voice actors in this game. It's slightly bled bledder? It's slightly better in Oblivion, but not by much. Okay, so what exactly did he just say to me? He was arrested, he was bragging, it was very stupid of him. He's in the dungeon. Okay. Of course, Skingrad has this weird system where it's detached from the rest of the city. I don't know how important that is. Oh, excuse the interruption. I had to I had to go feed my dogs. I have to be a responsible member of society. You understand. Of course now it's dark out. Oh, but it's very nice, isn't it? Yeah. I was about to say, oh, I should check if it's a full moon since I'm I'm going to go possibly see the vampire count. Uh, but then I, but then I realized, oh, that's not really a vampire thing, the full moon. But now it's too late because now I've I've said all of that anyway. So, so what's even the point? <laughs> Hello. Oh, I have to. <laughs> I have to go. I I know how stairs work. I guess that is the one downside of quest markers. Besides the fact that some people find them a little handholdy, uh, it is they don't really tell you the old uh, is that the Z axis? Maybe that's the, is that the Z axis? I don't know if that's the Z axis. Do I have to talk to you? Visitors ain't allowed down here. Okay. Um, this better be good. Oh god, do I even remember how to do the, the, the Persuade game? Uh-huh. Okay. Don't. What a dumb Christ. You win this one. Okay. Sorry. That's a... I can't argue. Don't try to manipulate... Don't, Don't try to manipulate I'm me. I am a... I am a That's man a, of the law. Sorry. My life is drab and wretched. Don't... And... That's such Lawmen never do anything bad, Not ever. You think I? That's enough. That's. I don't think that's you nearly mean, enough. Don't. That's. My life is dry. I see. I see. Um, will fifty gold open that no, door. But it will earn you two years in Skimbrad's dungeon. Now get lost before I decide to report you. I thought we built a rapport. I. I threatened you a bit. I told a couple jokes. You know, the usual. Uh, how's work in Castle Skingrad? I heard that Shum Grow Yara is looking to hire. He's the butler for the Count. Go speak to him. Huh. He doesn't leave Castle Skingrad often. At ten, he heads over to the Westfield Inn. Then at noon, he goes to the Colovian Trader. I thought you just said he doesn't... Okay. <laughs> Oh, he doesn't leave the castle that often, but you can find him at these outside locations at such and such times. At least two of them. Seems a little contradictory. But I like how that that opt... <laughs> uh, that's not shady at all, that I was like, oh, can I get in there? And he was like, no. And I immediately was like, so... Anyone hiring in the castle? <laughs> Any jobs? Ah, uh, you're you're the man. You're probably the only orc for like fifty square miles. Sorry, you want me? Yeah. I'm Sean Grogarog, the Count's butler. I wonder how much you know. Uh, I'd like to work in Castle Skingrad for purposes. I need someone to slot food to the prisoners. I'll pay you two gold a week plus half a loaf of bread. And a glass of mead each day. 
That is so pitiful. I'm having trouble hiring these days. So if you want the job, it's yours. I wonder why. Oh, is it because you... Okay. Will? I mean, <laughs> good. <laughs> uh, mind your manners in the castle. Stay out of Count Hasildur's quarters. And don't let me catch you in the wine cellar. Oh my god. The jail guards in the dungeon will unlock the cell block door if you ask them. Feed the prisoners once a day. I don't care when. Great. Get back to work. Yeah, okay. Well, I just- you just hired me. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, it's like- it's like McDonald's being like, I don't understand why the people don't want to come work for us when we offer such great benefits such as minimum wage and hamburgers <laughs> what do you want slop drudge how he just immediately he just immediately knew who i was he's a magic man they ought to just give you guys a key but no I gotta keep locking and unlocking the door for the slop drudges. Follow okay, me. that makes it sound like you are constantly letting slop drudges in, but what the butler guy just said implies that he's having trouble keeping people in this job. Which itself implies that there haven't been a lot of slop drudges or whatever the fuck he just said. Hello? Are you here to rescue me? Maybe. Just unlock the door. A couple of hours after you're gone, it'll be quiet again and I can sneak out. Great. Why am I doing this? Hey, tell me about- oh yeah, you have information. Tell me about Theranus. You mean the thief? Well, he was in the big cell with that Argonian. And they were always whispering to each other. The pale lady took him days ago. The pale lady? Uh, huh. Every few days, she comes for one of us. What? Some return. Some don't. Those that are taken three times never return. Who the fuck is the pale this lady? This was Theranus's third time. Ah, shit. Where is she taken? I don't know. She took the Argonian less than an hour ago, though. He put up quite a struggle. He was bleeding all over the place. Uh, I'll, I'm gonna have convenient blood pools to follow. That's good to know. Uh, any rumors that you know of from here in your dungeon cell? Anvil is all in an uproar. Oh my god. First the chapel attacked. Now the prophet ranting about the end of the world. Yeah, yeah. Everyone knows about that. I'll... Don't let the guards catch you. I guess I should... Should I... He just said... I'll... Oh, well I have the... Okay, I'm gonna give it a couple of attempts. And then I'm... And then I'm giving up on you, man. <laughs> oh, I'm doing great. Uh, <laughs> why? <laughs> My hubris. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't say anything. I should never say any anything ever. Great. You just have to. I thought you said you were gonna wait. Okay. Well. Oh, I didn't mean to. Okay. Anyone in here? Anyone in there? No. Oh, here's the convenient blood pools. Good to know. Um, oh good, he isn't just making a break for it, he's he's waiting. Although, okay, whatever, I don't know. <laughs> even, even from like a, oh, even, who am I stealing from when I steal those lockpicks? The skull? Sorry, man. <laughs> but even from like a story perspective, like not even thinking about like, the AI or gameplay or how things work. I feel like that man was not very bright. Also, I don't know what he was in here for. So the fact that I just freed him without asking any questions is a little concerning. Also, this might be like a really old part of the dungeon because it's like, oh, there's bars here and it's just a cave. I wonder if, uh, I wonder if the Count remembers those days. If he thinks back on them fondly. Okay, this seems pretty normal. Anyone? Is there anyone here? 
the wine cellar. <gasps> Was the orc guy trying to warn me? Do they know about the pale lady? Whoever the pale lady is. That might be a vampire. Because, I mean... That is... That is the vibe that this place is bringing to the table. Oh, is it? Ay, ay, ay. Should I talk to her? No. No, I don't think I'm going to talk to her. Oh, she's looking around. Oh, do you see this extremely obvious form at the end of the tunnel you're staring at? Well, you won't in a second. <laughs> Great. I hope that didn't count as murder. She is, I think, a murderer. It can't be murder to murder a murderer. Oop. Well, R.I.P. Oh, yeah, he is dead. Thank you, game. With the oh god, it's the Amusei guy. He's always managing to get into trouble. Uh, anything over here? Oh, there he is. Ay ay ay. Human blood. What is, what does human blood do? Oh, I've stole. Who have I stolen it from? <laughs> Drain fatigue and resist poison. Um. That's all right. How do I get rid of things? There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's right next to actual wine. So I guess she's just having a party. Hello. We need to get to safety. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just, are you the Argonian prisoner? Uh, that would be me. Mm -hmm. I am so glad you are here to save me from the vampire. Yeah, I would think seeing me at this Those point would be... Those skin grad guards caught me stealing a fish and locked me up. A fit? How do you, you steal... Okay. Again. You are a true friend. I will not forget this. Uh, I've decided to join the Thieves Guild. No more jails for me. <laughs> I, I don't know if I would consider myself your friend. Uh, I'm more like... A, a benevolent presence. Theranis? How do you know about him? He was my sailmate. At least until the pale lady took him away. Does she have an actual name? I mean, I guess it's too late to ask her. Do you know anything about a book? No, but he did give me a message about a treasure to deliver to the Thieves' Guild if I was ever to get out. That's very convenient. After the first time Theranis was taken by the Pale Lady, he knew he was going to die. That's a little sad. Get me out of the castle, and I'll give you his message. Ah, oh, tradesies. Okay, that that is fair. Do you know anything about her? Filthy vampire. <laughs> Filthy she took vampire. my cellmate Theranis a few days ago. If it hadn't been for you, I would have been next. Does Does the Count know about her? Let's go. Yeah, yeah, um... Why is it a person I- okay, oh no wait, that's what doors look like. Alright, let's go! <laughs> oh yeah, sneaky sneaky. We can do that, we can sneak. Um... We probably don't want to go back the way we came. So I guess we're just going to very extremely casually just get out here and everything's gonna be great yep. that's the butler guy what time is it what time is it two in the morning what are you doing escaping prisoners ah oh, shit uh, how do you, I'm not a prisoner, I'm a normal man, woman, I don't know why I got confused about that, he's fleeing, okay, it's time to go, <laughs> get me out of here, get Amase out of here, we're fucking leaving, he's still trying to sneak, I think that's a moot point, 
And now we're somewhere we're supposed to be. Oh god. Okay, um, uh, why is this? Okay, I'm just running. I'm just running. And I hope that Amy say, he's right here. Fantastic. Great. Fantastic and great. And there's no one out here. That's even greater. Is there anyone out here? No. Okay, let's fucking move. Why are you still crouching? <laughs> it's time to move. Alright, I'll, I'll just wait for you over here. They've got a portcullis. Wow. Isn't that incredible? Wouldn't that not really close so well over these bits? Anyway. Okay, here we go. You really don't need to sneak anymore, bud. I think we're good. I'm just gonna walk backwards and stare at you. Aha! We've officially escaped. Anything for my savior. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, well, I mean, it's probably good to have someone like this in your corner. I mean, he might try to steal from me, but then maybe he's he's learned the value of being among, like, a, 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 gr a friend group, shall we say. Uh, and so maybe, maybe it'll all work out. Tell me about the lost histories of Tamriel. He told me to give this message to any member of the Thieves' Guild that asked about him or a book. Look under the bush near the well behind the restaurant's house. I was going to take it for myself, but I owe you a great debt. You should take it. <laughs> How very generous of you. Uh, you got any sick rumors from your time with the Pale Lady? Oh, fuck's boy. sake. I'm not even... Okay, bye. Safe journey. Yeah, you too. You wasted my time. <laughs> now, I think Nerestril or whatever the heck, was the name of some necromancer who left behind an abandoned house in Skingrad. In fact, I think that's the house that you can personally purchase in Skingrad, since every town has a house you can purchase, except for Kavach, obviously. Look at this. What? what? <laughs> um, but first you have to clear out zombies and stuff. Kind of like how the, the house in Anvil has you clearing out uh, ghosts. Uh, here it is. The Lost Histories of Tamriel. Earlier volume, blah blah blah, not even magic can affect the word written by these ancient pages. How very magical. Uh, return it to Scriva. And she's in Breville. I'm just gonna fast travel to Breville. I've had the drive experience. The ride experience. I mean, a, a horse is just a car. If you really think about it. What is it? So cold. All right. I got the goods. I know you've been waiting a while, but I'm here. I have it. I have the thing. I know you've been waiting a couple of years, but I finally got you the book. Yes, yes, indeed. You have found Theranus and the lost histories of Tamriel? Uh, yes. Theranus is dead? I grieve for him. Yes, but at it's least all very sad. Had the, book. the Grey Fox has sought this book for many years. Oh. You have earned the reward. Here is your payment. Great. Ay, ay, ay. You got any special jobs for me? Hieronymus Lex must be eliminated once and for all. Oh. The Grey Fox has asked that you do this personally. It is a most delicate matter. Ah, yes. I am... I am well versed in eliminating problems. Countess Umbernox of Anvil is hunting for a new hmm. captain of her guard. The Legion Commander of the Imperial Watch sent her a list of candidates. The Grey Fox wants this list replaced with one that highly recommends Hieronymus Lex. For Manville, he can do little harm to the group. <laughs> uh, considering what happens later in this quest line, that, that, that's kind of funny. Uh, where is the letter? The letter is currently in Steward Darahill's desk. She has lied to Lady Umbernox 
telling her that the letter has yet to arrive. Why would she lie to her? Um, oh, well, okay. I guess she's been paid off by the East Guild. Why not just kill him? I say, slowly pulling out one of my many knives. We are thieves, not murderers. That is the province of the Dark Brotherhood. For reasons unknown to this one. The Grey Fox has extended his protection to the Umbernox family, and Lady Umbernox in particular. Hmm, I wonder why. While Lex is a problem for the Guild, his unwavering loyalty and resolve make him the perfect protector for Lady Umbernox. Okay. So he's not necessarily the worst person. Although I think I pointed out in a former video that for all of his talk about, like, making the city a better place for everyone, he sure doesn't have any problems with harassing the poor folks at the waterfront. Uh, but how do I forge the letter? You will have to track down one on your own. I don't know of any in Breville. With the forged do you mean a forger? In hand, okay. Sneak into the Legion commander's office in the Imperial City prison and seal it with his seal. Ooh. Darahill cannot be trusted. You must deliver the letter to Lady Umbernox in person. Will you accept this commission? Yes, it shall be done. That is good. Remember, this is a mission of stealth, not blood. Your payment will be higher than normal to cover the expense of the forgery. I, I don't know why you feel like you have to remind me that there's no blood involved. I'm a very, Shadow hide a very peaceful, non-murdering individual. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay. I must have sold some good shit a couple of years ago, because <laughs> I haven't had to worry about the fencing for a while. Alright, Anvil is so far away, I think I'm just gonna fast travel there, and then I'll make a grand journey. Uh, a grand, grand journey um, all the way to the Imperial City, where I have to seal the letter. And then, of course, I guess I would have to come back. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm sure it's fine. I got time. I got nothing but time. All right, here we are in Anvil. Um, uh, well, the markers, of course, are gonna be... Have I been... Of course I've been in Anvil. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, oh, new topic pilgrimage implies that maybe I haven't been here because, oh, the uh, prophet or whatever, and the murders and the church and yada yada, but I've, I've been here before. Um, because you have to come here to join the Fighters Guild. So is this what passes for entertainment? For the Navy! I'm only asking for enough to feed me kids. Okay. Um, tell me about the steward Darahill. To be honest, I, I couldn't give you directions to any special room in the castle. Anyone in the castle can tell you, though. Oh, he's a magic However, man. He didn't even move his free, lips for that there one. There are many secrets in that castle. There are secret ways and secret people. My god, this is the second That's beggar I've talked to today whose voice changed, like, mid-read. <laughs> oh boy, poor voice actors. Okay. Uh, you know what? I didn't even catch what he was saying. I was I was too entranced by the non-movement of his mouth. Okay, so it isn't just it isn't just uh Skingrad that has the separate castle. Hello. Um it's also Anvil. Ay ay ay. I feel like I recognize you. Oh yeah, you're a fighter skill lady. I don't know why you're here. It's my pleasure. Please continue. Hi, is anything up with you? Way shrines of RK. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that one before. Okay. You have a grand old time standing here. Yep. Okay. Well <laughs> what am I after? <laughs> Uh, maybe secret ways. 
find the blacksmith? I'm not really sure. What okay, so even the game is like, yeah, you don't know. <laughs> Great. Love that. Love that for me. Ah, uh, blacksmith. Dude, that is sick. It probably doesn't even do as much damage as it looks like it should, but that is... Oof. You must be the cat burglar I've been told oh. to expect. Shh. Follow me. Yes, okay, I follow you. Man, he's got a legit little setup here. Hm. Don't get anything like that until, well, nothing functional anyway until Skyrim. Hm. Oh. A secret passage. It should let me get closer to Dare Hill's office without being seen by the castle guards. Superb. Hi there! I see you work with the Grey Fox. Y yeah. Uh, anything you can tell me about her office? Looking for the steward, are you? Her office is in the private chambers, but she's not there much. Oh, good. You can find her in the audience chamber in the mornings. She dines with the Countess from evening's eighth bell until midnight. That is a long time to just dine with someone. And until midnight, oh my god. Well, nobles are on a different level, I think. Okay. Oh, great. At least, I think in one of my more recent videos, I purchased a bunch of lockpicks. That's good. Of course, since there's kind of a face-like quality to the lockpicking interface, YouTube will probably suggest a thumbnail that looks like that. Uh, but I'm sure it's fine. We'll, we'll figure it out together. You and I. I. Say you as if this is an interactive medium. Like this is Dora the Explorer. And I can turn to you, the viewer, and say, Do you know how to pick a lock? How many tumblers do I need to set? In you go. You need to- oh. Sorry, friend, it looks like you've wandered in- I'm Darahill, steward of uh, Castle Okay. Goodbye. Yeah, I'm getting out of here, I'm getting out of here, I'm getting out of here. Alright. <laughs> oh, she's never in her office. You don't need to worry about that. God. Okay. Um, you know what? I should wait until... Yeah. If she's dining with the Countess from 8 until midnight, then she won't be in her office. Unless the Countess comes and dines with her in her office. Which would be... I guess a show of humility. She didn't close this. That's very nice of her. Don't even worry about it. Oh, but she did relock this. Bummer. All right, kids. How many tumblers do I have to set? One, two, three. Great. It's <laughs> gonna close that. Uh, recipe. Hello. Restore fatigue. No, thank you. Hand bill. The beds of the Count's arms are the softest in Anvil. We wash them after every third customer. <laughs> oh god, okay. Um, that's nice. Um, do you have anything valuable? No? Okay, I'm just gonna... Alright kids! How many tumblers are there? One. One. Two. Three. Great! I couldn't have done this without your help. Now I just need to find a forger. Now I think I do have a memory of where I can find a forger. <sighs> hey guys, how many tumblers do I have to start? Is it one? Is it one? Is it two?
Is it one? Is it two? Or could it be? It's three! Oh, uh, you're so useless to me. God. Oh, Nurn Root. Oh, I found a total of ten Nurn Root. Oh, I should return to Cinderian. Wow. Not right now, but hey, it's an idea, I guess. Wow, she has nothing. Great. How are we? How are we doing? Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Move, 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 move. I think one of my dogs might be barking, but hopefully you can't hear that. <laughs> Is he still gonna be just standing here? No, he has some subtlety, which makes sense if he's with the Thieves Guild. Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you supposed to be training dummies? Look like coconuts. Anyway. Every I'm sh uh, every day I'm just full of insights. A few moments later. And my disk drive ran out of room, so I think with that I guess that's gonna be the end of this recording. Yes, we'll see if I don't come. Okay, I. With that, on that glorious note, uh, I guess that's the end of this particular video. We'll see when I upload next. Yeah, it's gonna be a grand old time. I do love this game, and I love recording videos for all, all, all three of you, all, t all, all one of you. <laughs> all right. This is Boogledorf, signing off. I hope you have a good day. Bye-bye!